Let's just follow this through, alright? Let's just follow this through. I, I, I gotta show you guys where this is going. <laughs> oh my god. Yo. <laughs> so this is the keyboard. Mouse is on the bottom. This is just the D sub connected to this monitor. Power is off right now, but I've already had it on about twice now. There's no SSD or a hard drive or anything in here just yet. But what we got going is this is a Corsair A50 with a jerry-rigged cooler in the back or um, fan in the back. This is seriously jerry-rigged by freaking twist ties. This and this or yeah this thing is a twist tie. This is where the hard drive or SSD would be connected to but I don't have one yet. Where am I gonna put the hard drive or the SSD? I don't know. Of, it's over damn sure that there's no graphics that's gonna go on this so I'm gonna make a cardboard platform on top of the PCIe ports put the SSD and hard drive right on top of each other put that there or just a hard drive or an SSD or something so yeah this is good board I've seen it on a few builds on YouTube they got a thermal take, 700 watt power supply, um, silver, 80 plus silver, and my messy cable management because I don't have a case for this. This is an old HP Pavilion case that was gutted out. And this used to be my old potato. The parts here along with the junk that's on top of it are my computer parts. You have the, what you see that silver thing is, is my old DVD hard drive enclosure that goes where the now power supply is. That's the side panel. I'm just gonna show you guys the photo. Hope you guys enjoyed that potato. So, does it work? You're about to find out and also the wire that you see here the line flashing it uh it's like shining on it that's how i'm gonna turn on my computer instead of a screwdriver this is the former eject button for the dvd cd player that used to be in my potato let's see your spin All right, <laughs> and there it is, there it is. So we have entered the BIOS, Motherboard Works. Uh, it's picking up the eight gigs of RAM. It's about 3.8 gigahertz, and it's cooled by that janky Corsair. That has Cooler Master fans on it instead of the Corsair fan that went in onto it. These, this is what I've done with the extra parts of my build.